What's going on you guys? Matthew here back with another video and today we are going to Solenad which is located in Santa Rosa City and Santa Rosa City is actually located in Laguna which is a separate province from Metro Manila and it will only take around half an hour to an hour to get from our house to Solenad that's because we are taking the South Luzon Expressway and the reason why we are going to Solenad is to have some dinner and we brought David with us today so if you have been watching my youtube channel for a long time you know that i have a corgi named david but anyway the last time we went there i actually had an accident i wrecked my knee i wrecked my hand and i wrecked my camera i took a bad i took a bad fall the title of that video will be in the screen right now but anyway we are now along south luzon expressway so like what i said david is with us today so as you can see david sleeping right now but anyway, we are now along South Luzon Expressway. Okay guys, so we finally ar arrived here at Solinad and there's dog hair everywhere. But anyway guys, it usually takes around half an hour for us just to find a parking spot. But thankfully, we were able to find a parking spot quite, quite quick. And the parking spot that we got is actually very near the entrance. So thankfully, we were able to find a parking spot quite quick quick and this parking spot is actually right near the entrance but anyway we are now here with david and we are now gonna go inside solenad but it's uh, and on and in our way here it was actually raining quite hard and until now the sky is quite gloomy but thankfully when we arrived here um the rain stopped but the sky is still quite gloomy so like what i said guys we were able to find a parking spot that was near the entrance um, and it didn't take that long for us to find a parking spot but on our way here it was actually raining quite hard but thankfully it's not raining anymore but the sky is still quite gloomy okay guys so we're now here with David and we had to pass through the grass because David did not know how to come down through the stairs so we had to pass through the grass okay guys so we are now here with David and we just took a stop at the coffee bean and tea leaf because my dad wants to drink some coffee. Okay guys, so we are now here with David and we've been finding a restaurant for the past half an hour. And while we were finding a restaurant, it started to rain heavily. And now it's raining really hard. But anyway, we're now finding a restaurant. Okay guys, so we have been finding a restaurant for about half an hour and we finally decided where we're gonna eat. Okay guys, so the restaurant that we decided to eat at was TGIF, which stands for Thank God It's Fridays. But anyway, we just got a seat and we're now deciding what we're going to order. Okay guys, so we just decided what we're going to eat, so I decided to go with the Friday Signature Country Ribs and Shrimp. So it comes with the ribs itself some shrimp and some fries okay guys so um while we're ordering they also brought in the chips okay guys so the chips here are for free so they give you free chips they also have the dip over here they have the dip which i think is salsa Okay guys, so the or, our order just arrived, so this is the ribs, so we got the uh, full rack of the ribs, so it comes with the ribs itself, the fries, um, the sh fried shrimp, it also comes with coleslaw, and we also got two cups of rice. So this is the ribs and shrimp platter, it comes with the ribs, fries, coleslaw, fr and fried shrimp. Okay guys, so let's first try their signature ribs, here's the ribs. Wow, it's so tender. And it tastes so good. Wow, look at that ribs. Mm. The ribs are so good. Look at these ribs. Look how tender that is. Mm. 
That's so tender, that's so juicy, and it tastes amazing. Mm. So good. I definitely recommend the ribs. So good. Okay, guys, now let's try their fries. There's their fries. Just the right amount of salt, just the right amount of pepper. It's amazing. And lastly, let's try the fried shrimp. Wow. That's a lot of pepper. But it's so good. The shrimp has quite a lot of pepper, but it tastes absolutely amazing. I definitely recommend the shrimp. That's so good. Okay, guys, so we are now done eating. I am so full. I am stuffed to the brim. And we actually brought the leftover bones for David because David really likes the bones. So we decided to bring the leftover bones for David. But anyway guys, I'm so full. The ribs was really good. It was very tender. It was moist. It was not dry. It was well seasoned and just amazing. The shrimp was really good as well. It was also well seasoned. And the fries just had the right amount of salt and pepper. Overall, the ribs and shrimp platter was amazing. I definitely recommend you to try the ribs and shrimp platter. It tasted absolutely amazing. But anyway guys, we are now going to the parking area. That's gonna, that's gonna be it for this video guys. Don't forget guys to drop a big thumbs up for this video. And subscribe. Thank you so much guys for watching. And I will see you in the next video.